Hey guys, I wanted to tell you what happened in a recent experiment we did with coffee in my Keto Close Facebook group. It's called Dr. Berg's Keto and Intermittent Fasting Lab, okay? We have about 40,000 members right now, so we're gonna be doing all sorts of experiments. This is our first experiment. I wanna tell you what we found. This is a kind of a general experiment. I'm gonna do another one to uh, drill down uh, less variables, more standard, more people. But I wanted to at least give you some of the results with this generalized study. And basically all we did is we measured the ketones before and after drinking coffee, okay? And this was no food involved. It was just straight coffee. Some people added cream, some people didn't. So basically we just wanted to see what would happen with ketones. Okay, this is what we found, which is actually quite surprising. Um, we found the ketones increased after drinking coffee which is interesting. And there is some data that I found that coffee can increase the free fatty acids from the liver. And that's probably what's happening because this fat is being converted to ketones. Now, I'm gonna do some more investigation on if that's actually true or if there's some other reasons, but I also found some interesting data because I have a testing kit that measures both blood sugars and ketones. Okay, so I checked my blood sugars, which I was surprised it went up a little bit. So my blood sugars went up and my ketones went up myself. So the blood sugars weren't even a part of the study because I didn't tell people to test their blood sugars, but the next test I will have people check both the blood sugars and the ketones to see if there was a difference. And I'm sure someone's gonna ask um, what device you could find that will measure both ketones and blood sugars. There's not a lot of them out there, but I'll put a little link down below of this one. It's called MD6. Uh, Bluetooth, I guess it's Bruno, high accuracy blood glucose and beta ketone monitoring system. So you can maybe get one similar to this, but it, I think it's important to measure your glucose and ketones just to see what happens with both. Okay, so stay tuned for more interesting results from the studies that we're gonna be doing in the next coming weeks. Hey, if you haven't already subscribed, press the button below and I will keep you in the know. Hey, that rhymes.